back like we never left. What is good, everybody? If you are new to the channel, allow me to reintroduce myself. My name is Weave, and here on my channel, we coach you through three critical aspects of your life. First, on your personal growth and development. Second, we continue to push you towards professional success as you continue to grow in your careers in business and entrepreneurship. Third, we always help you to build, maintain, and nurture long, lasting, and more meaningful relationships. Today's video was inspired by an email coaching session where we discussed not waiting for someone to be ready to commit to you. Now, you know how I am, right? I don't like to waste time and I'm ready to get into it, so let's do that right now. Love cannot be measured by how long you wait. It's about how well you understand why you are waiting. Let me be perfectly clear about something before we dive in. One day, someone will walk into your life and make you realize why it never really worked out with anybody else. But too many times what I see is people get caught in these webs of situationships. Wait, what do you mean by a web weave? I mean the person who really likes a man or a woman who is already in a relationship with someone else? Yeah, you know what I'm talking about, right? The person you're sleeping with or caught feelings for is already taken and you're waiting for them to leave them because they really want you and love you right? Or the other situation I see that's common is waiting for a larger commitment from the current relationship that you're in. And that ranges from making the relationship official, girlfriend and boyfriend, or husband and wife. But to the person who's waiting, it feels like an eternity if you are in love with them, right? So should you continue to wait or are you wasting your time? And my answer to you would be, it really depends. Wait, depends on what though? It depends on your expectations. It depends on the conversations that you had with this man or woman about what you want and if you are willing to wait for it. It depends on if you think someone who is currently leaving their current girlfriend or boyfriend or husband or wife for you isn't going to do the same to you in the future. It's complicated, right? Because for as much as you may be tired of waiting, you also haven't walked away yet, right? Because your heart's still in it. Because you're in love with them. But something keeps telling you that this shouldn't really take this damn long. And unfortunately, these types of situations cause you to justify the behavior of your partner or the person that you're dating. Because now you sometimes feel like you're being unreasonable and asking for what you want and what your expectations are. But what are your expectations? And what are you being unreasonable about? Being that unreasonable reasonable and asking for commitment? Asking for them to level up your situation or your relationship? Because the thought is, what if they actually say no? So let's explore that for a second. What if they do? How long though have you been waiting? How long have you been asking for them to commit to you? How many times do you have to ask for what you know you deserve? Because here's my belief. When you know what you want, you go after it. You don't make excuses. You expedite the process and make what you want a priority. So when we talk about waiting, yes, patience is important in any growing relationship. But if you are getting dragged at a snail's pace with a commitment, if it's been months or years of the same lame ass story that you've been hearing as to why things aren't happening, if your frustration level is at a 10 with the excuses, if you're not satisfied with where things are and it's affecting your stress and anxiety on a daily basis, then it doesn't sound like a productive relationship now, does it? And I understand that there are quotes and people that tell you, if it's worth waiting for, then wait. But I would subscribe to tell you that if it's worth waiting for and you have already been waiting a long ass time for it, then it's time to make decisions that prioritize your own joy. Stop protecting this man or woman's feelings by not speaking your peace about things, by not giving them your true feelings about where things are versus where you feel things should be. Maybe they have no clue that it's something that you even want because you haven't spoke on it before. But if you have and you aren't seeing any movement or progression in the process, then why the hell do you keep banging your head against the wall hoping that they will figure it out? Clearly what you have tried, said, or hoped for isn't working. So it's time to make a decision for you and you alone. A decision that might require you to walk away because you have been waiting too damn long. And no, change doesn't typically come overnight when you're dealing with love and relationships. But it damn sure doesn't take years to leave a current relationship. It doesn't take 10 years to get married. It doesn't take two years to be an official couple. 
So are you wasting your time? Or are you being impatient? Are you being unreasonable? Or are they just playing games with your emotions and keeping you around? Because they can. Whatever the answer is, you need to find out. And if their answer is something that you are unwilling to compromise on, then you need to chalk it up to the game and move on. Keep your happiness top of mind because in the end, you are the longest commitment that you will ever have. You can't spend the best years of your life waiting for somebody to love you back. As always, thank you to every single one of you for tuning in and checking out this video today. And if no one has told you this already today, I appreciate you. If you found some value in this video, make sure that you like, comment, and share it as well. If you're new to the channel, I want you to become official to the squad. So hit that subscribe button and that bell notification down bottom so you can become an official part of the team. I'll be back soon with another new video, but until then, have an amazing day. Stay strong and stay inspired. And as always, until I see you guys next time, Peace.